Hello and welcome to Living Life with Purpose. I'm your host, Phil Foster. Well, I don't know what it's like where you're at, but here in Athens, uh, as you look around our community, all the students are coming back, and it's kind of funny during the summer, you like lose 20,000 plus people, and then the last of August, you gain another 20,000, and uh, the whole city comes back to life. And, uh, and I got thinking about each school year, um, I know my own kids have just went back to school. It gets me thinking about a few things, and today I was thinking about new beginnings. And the great thing about serving Jesus is He is the God of the second chance. In 2 Corinthians chapter 5, it says, Old things are passed away, behold, all things have become new. So maybe you're watching this today, say, Well, my whole life I've heard that God loves me and that God has a great plan and a purpose for my life and that He wants to save me. But if you only knew how bad I'd been, listen, I don't need to know how bad you've been. God already knows. But here's the deal God gave us the great exchange. 2,000 years ago, Jesus came and took upon the, himself the form of flesh through the incarnation. He lived a perfect, sinless life. And then he went to Calvary, to the cross. There he shed his blood. And as you know the story, he was raised on the third day. And the day the Bible is very clear. It doesn't matter who you are, where you've been, what you've done. If you call on the name of the Lord, you can be saved. So when you give your life to Christ, the Bible said that God took all the things wrong in your life and he covered them over. And it doesn't mean they didn't exist, but God chose to forgive you and give you a fresh start. If you've never done that, inbox me here on Facebook uh, or YouTube. I'd like to hear from you. I'd like to help show you how to receive Christ, how you can live for God. If He can do it for me, He can do it for you. So look, there's so much I could say. If you have any questions, get up with me. But until we get together tomorrow, may God bless you. And hey, have a great day.